Mm. Okay. Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. Jeez, and that caught Nelson. Second time he's been hit. And now a visit from Steve Donahue to make sure that Jeff is okay. Okay. Yeah, He's I think I am. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to get a glass of water in the mid 80s. Okay. I'm good. good yeah, person, thanks. Great trainer. Uh, it's too uh, yeah, it's two good ones. Comes down to check on the home plate umpire and crew chief. That catch him in the mask? Yeah. Straight on. And that's why they're checking him and why Steve was looking into the eyes. And they're making sure that that was not a mound visit right and that's the signal by Jeff Nelson well we are going to get an umpire change here we showed you that foul tip that went directly into the mask of Jeff Nelson and that's unfortunate because that's what it takes it's not an easy transition to get a home plate umpire uh, uh, dressed up and ready you have to wonder what these fans at Yankee Stadium think. I don't believe they made an announcement, but right now they're looking down in a 2 nothing game in the fifth inning of an ALCS. I think it would uh, probably do well to make an announcement here at the stadium, but we're going to flip your mic on, John, and you can tell the crowd what's going on. First of all, you lose a real good umpire behind the plate in the crew chief. And now we're going to have a switch and see who takes over behind the plate. Meanwhile, the Yankees, John, were sending Severino back out there. Yes. So they announced shortly after we went to break the entire umpire rotation, and that was helpful. Kerwin Danley is going to move from second base to the plate. Jeff Nelson will sit the rest of this one out. Dan Bellino stays at first. Mark Carlson at second Marvin Hudson moves from the outfield to third base Corey Blazer stays in right and there is no left field umpire for the rest of this postseason game still one more than you get during the regular season anyway well the delay is going to be much longer obviously for Garrett Cole than it will be for that's not Kerwin Dam that is not. So his gear let's see he would have worked the plate here on Thursday. So all these guys travel with all their gear just in case. And we are it's going to be a hero's reception for Kerwin Danley when he pops out of that tunnel. Here at Yankee Stadium it's kind of like waiting for a plane and just waiting for the stewardess to get there so you can get on and go the flight attendants <laughs> flight attendants yeah. right. old man. <laughs> As you can't tell from here who is coming into the game. Poppy, for if you're in this lineup tonight, you know what? They're getting ready to play. Guys are back on the field. Oh, the day and, in the uh, break. Right now, go back to Joe Jump and John. My boy. Play ball. Joe. All right, guys, thank you. Yeah, it is Severino, and we'll see how he gets along. And I think you brought up the best point of all of it is also Garrett Cole and his time away from the mound is extended. Yeah, he has the longest time, and certainly. We'll see if he chooses to go throw a little bit while his team's batting. Well, nothing wrong with that as a mid 90s fastball goes.